Hello students, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to see our exercise 3.5 constructions. So here, three sides and two angles. Included angles were given. We have to construct. First one, construct a quadrilateral PQRS with the given measurements. So write the given measurements first and just draw the rough diagram. Okay. So drawing the rough diagram is the first basic important step here. If you draw the rough diagram easily and you, if you wrote the given measurements in this rough diagram, you can easily construct it. Okay. So what is first here? PQ. So take write PQ. What is PQ? 3.6 centimeters. Here the quadrilateral name is PQRS. So PQRS. So QR is 4.5 centimeters. Next RS, this one 5.6 centimeters. Now angle PQR, that means this middle letter. At angle Q, at Q the angle is 135 degrees. Next angle QRS, 60 degrees, this one. Okay, now this is the rough diagram. So what is our first step in the construction means? Drawing rough sketch or rough diagram, whatever it is. Now take the scale and draw a line segment of length 3.6 cm. So 3.6 centimeters is drawn. Now angle Q 135 degrees. So take the protractor and this middle line is 90. 135 means it is greater than 90 only. That means right side of 90. So it is here between 130 and 140. Above scale here we have to take. So this one and draw a ray in this direction. Okay, let it be QX. Now, what is QR? 4.5 centimeters. So, what is this QR? 4.5 centimeters. So, take the compass and measure 4.5 centimeters radius and with Q as center, draw an arc. Okay. The intersection of this arc and ray is R. Okay. Now, what is angle R? 60 degrees. Right. So, take the protractor. Okay. Many of the students will get confused how to take 60. That means here are two scales you are seeing. Below scale and above scale, down scale and above, up scale. So what scale you have to follow means first you just identify 90. It is in between this here 90, right? Now we have to measure this 60 degrees. 60 means it is less than 90 only. Less than means smaller numbers always right left side of a number, right? So now take above scale here 60. Okay, very simply you can locate it without get confusing. So draw an arc. Sorry, a ray this is. So here 60 degrees and it is 135 degrees. So now in the rough diagram we have RS is 5.5. 6 centimeters. So take the scale and compass measure 5.6 centimeters radius. With this R as center, draw an arc. Okay. If the intersecting point is yes. Now join this PS. This is the required quadrilateral. Okay. 
So if you are able to draw the rough diagram, then it is very easy to construct. Okay. So this is the required quadrilateral PQRS. Steps of construction. First one, a rough sketch is drawn for the given measurements. And next, a ray QX is drawn such that angle PQX is equal to 135 degrees. Taking Q as center with 4.5 centimeters radius, an arc is drawn onto this ray. It intersected R. Next, another ray RY. This RY is drawn such that angle QRY is 60 degrees. Now, taking R as center with 5.6 centimeters as radius, an arc is drawn onto the ray RY. It intersects at S. Next, by joining P and S, required quadrilateral PQRS is formed. Second one, quadrilateral lamp with AM is equal to MPPL and angle M, angle P. Okay. So, first write the given measurements and draw a rough diagram. Okay. So, first A, M. What is this AM? So, this is quadrilateral lamp. So, L, A, M, P. AM, 5 centimeters. And next, M, P also 5 centimeters. P, L also 5 centimeters. And angle M is 90. And angle P is 60 degrees. So, this is the rough sketch. So, first step is draw a line segment of length 5 centimeters. So, 5 centimeters line is drawn. Next, angle M 90 degrees. So, draw a ray like this. So, this is 90 degrees. MP 5 centimeters. So, take the compass and measure 5 centimeters. So, by taking M as center, draw an arc. So, it intersects at P. Now, in the problem, we have angle P 60 degrees. Right? So, take the, take the protractor and represent 60 degrees angle. So, this is 90. 60 means it is less than 90. So, left side of 90. So, above scale here we have to take. So, that is 60. So, draw a ray like this. Okay. And it is angle 60. Now, again we have PL is equal to 5 centimeters. So, so measure the same 5 centimeters and with P as center, draw an arc onto this ray. It intersects at L. Okay. Now, just join this A and L. This is the required quadrilateral LAMP lamp. Okay. Steps of construction. First one. A rough sketch is drawn for given measurements. And next a line segment AM 5 cm is drawn. A ray MX is drawn such that angle MX is equal to 90 degrees. And next an arc is drawn with M as center and radius 5 cm on to this ray MX. It intersect at P. And next, another arc from P, P, Y is drawn such that angle M, P, Y is equal to 60 degrees. Now, taking P as center, this P as center, with 5 cm radius, an arc is drawn. It intersect at L. So, by joining this P and L, the required quadrilateral LAMP is formed. Third problem. Trapezium ABCD in which AB parallel to CD and 
these are the measurements so write the given measurements and draw a quadrilateral first ab okay ab and cd ab 8 cm and bc 6 cm this cd 4 cm and angle b 60 degrees so if you observe here in the above two problems they gave two angles right so 135 and 60 but here only one angle so the second angle we have to find out okay so here they are telling ab parallel to cd so ab parallel to cd means these two are parallel and this bc is like this one line so this is transversal line right so this is ab and this is cd and it is some line bc okay if any line is like this it is called transversal so transversal line means the angles lying on the same side of this transversal line okay and this angle c and here these are supplementary that means the sum of these two angles is 180 if i said this x and this is y so x plus y is 180 degrees because this is transversal line okay so in the same pattern in trapezium abcd ab parallel to cd so angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degrees so we know angle b that is 60 and angle c 180 degrees so angle c is equal to 180 degrees 60 when it comes to right it is minus so angle c finally 120 degrees okay so what is the angle c 120 degrees so now we will construct it a line segment ab 8 cm is drawn then next angle b 60 degrees so take the protractor and this is 90 90 means less 90 60 here we have 60 means less than 90 so it is left side so above scale this is 60 so draw a ray okay next bc is 6 cm we have so take the compass and measure 6 cm radius and from b draw an arc onto this ray bx this is 60 degrees and the intersecting point is c now we have angle c 120 degrees so take the protractor and it is 90 we have 120 it is greater than that means right side of 90 so above scale and here we have 120 so draw a ray cy cy okay now what is cd 4 cm so take the protractor and measure 4 cm okay so now with the c as center draw an arc the intersecting point of these two take as d now just join this ca and d this is the required trapezium okay 
steps of construction first one a rough sketch is drawn for the given measurements and next a line segment a b 8 cm is drawn a ray b x is drawn such that angle a b x is 60 degrees next by taking this b as center draw an arc of radius 6 cm onto this ray b x it intersect at c okay intersecting point is c next another arc cy is drawn such that angle b c y is equal to 120 degrees next taking c as center with radius 4 cm an arc is drawn on the ray cy okay it cuts at d so finally by joining this a and d the required quadrilateral ABCD is formed.